Hello everyone! Welcome back to Hate Plus. Did you know I just checked my Steam stats? I have been playing this game, I've played this game for about 20 hours. Oh my god, that blows my mind. 20 freaking hours in this game! I can't believe I've spent that much time inside of it. Okay, well, let's continue with day three of the female Hyunae route where I treat her like complete crap and feel terrible about myself. Yay, let's go. After all that heavy stuff from yesterday, let's maybe take it a little slow before we get started. Given the stuff we did yesterday with boring, stuffy ritual food, I was thinking maybe today we could do something more fun. Oh, this is gonna be the bake, the cake thing. <sighs> God, how is this gonna go? You know what I'm thinking? Cake cake. Okay, how's, how's this gonna go? So we can eat together? <laughs> so, so, okay, so... If you've already done it, you can say we already did it in another timeline. Because it would be kind of ridiculous to every single time you replay the game, you bake another cake. So this is a way you can get out of it. You don't have to bake another cake, and you don't have to lie to her and say that you did. But I'm playing the be a complete dick route, so I'm going to go with I'd rather not. Oh, God. Please, if you're really shaken up by what we read about Mute, I don't think I'm ready to go back to thinking about it. Will you do this for me? Just this once, please? You know, after I got married, I couldn't really appreciate food, given well. I'm sure you understand. And then for 622 years, I haven't even had a body. I just want to share a cute little moment with you. I just wanted something to remind me of my real mother. Please, won't you do that for me? Just once? Don't you think I deserve that? Oh god, I... Uh, this is horrible. Yo, you don't deserve to be happy! Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh. That, oh my god, that's almost too far for me. I... Fuck. This is painful, but... I need to stay committed to this pathway and see where it leads. Uh, you don't deserve to be happy. I'm sorry, Hane, I'm sorry. Fine, I give up. You, you're impossible. I thought somehow you'd be different from all the others, but no, you're just as cruel. Why? Why do you have to be this way? I'm through. I refuse to keep talking to you. Connection error. Oh my god, what the hell happens now? Attempting to reconnect. Reconnection fa- Wow. She- Yeah. Wait a minute, what is this? Wait, create a new... Does this end the day? Like, is that it? Like, now it's just silence all the way to Earth? Is, is that it? Create a new save file. All done. Well, good night. That's weird. It gives you the text as if everything was normal. Even though she's just said she doesn't want to talk to you. It's been a really exhausting day, hasn't it? We'll see you tomorrow. Is that, that's the end, isn't it? Wait, what? Wait, I'm confused. Did, I thought that was day three. Why did that just say day two? What, what, hold on, what's what's happening? Uh, what? Did I just encounter a bug or am I misunderstanding something? That is day three. And it doesn't even say that you need to wait. What just happened? Uh... What? Okay, let's create another save. All done, good night. I just made another save. Now it says two hour, end of day two. But that was end of day three. What? Um, what? Okay, I have no idea what's happening. But it's obvious that whatever I just did doesn't work. Let's be a bit less of a dick. Oh, no, hold on. Need to go back one more. This one, I think, right? Beginning of the day. Uh, 
Okay, yeah. We already did in another timeline. That's a weird thing to say. Yes, it is. And I don't really understand what that means. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry about it. But somehow in my heart, I feel like that's true, and I feel like it's a good enough answer. I don't really understand, but I can't argue with those feelings. Very well, let's get back to work then. Yeah, I don't know. Wait, one more thing. Uh, so there's one thing before we get started. I realized that you know how there were a lot of files that just look like junk data? Well, I think they're actually just encrypted with the same key that Mute's last note was. As far as I can tell, it's a whole block of log files about Oyana. Anyway, I'm nervous to read them, but I just thought you should know. Okay, yeah, I don't know what the hell just happened with that whole cake thing. I, is that a bug? If it's not a bug, then what the hell was happening? She's saying she didn't want to talk to me, which I thought was going to mean that we just end the day. We don't read any of the more note, you know, any more of the notes, and then we just go back to Earth, and would end day three. But when I saved, it said end of day two, you have to wait 12 hours. But then when I checked the save file, it said end of, it was day three. And I didn't have to wait 12 hours. I, I don't... I don't understand. Anyway, let's get to extracting. I'm actually... I'm actually relieved that I don't have to go through treating her like crap. At least not completely like crap. I mean, I've been a dick to her in this playthrough so far, but going so far as to say you don't deserve to be happy? That is just horrible on a whole new level. Can we take a break for a minute? Sure. Um, there's something I want to confess to you. Mm -hmm. If this is what your job is normally like, I think it's really great. I'm not being a burden on you, am I? You don't mind me, uh, you don't mind having me as a sidekick, right? Oh god. It's a little trying. What? Oh jeez, I'm sorry. Um, I'll try to be less of a burden, I promise. No, oh, god. I just really like being able to do some, uh, being able to do something together with you. It's just been so long since I've had a friend to be with. And uh, hey, Miss Investigator, I think you're really cool, traveling through space, solving mysteries. I can't wait until we get back to Earth, doing footwork, interrogating people, being out there in the world. I never would have dreamed, when I was stuck in the women's quarters of an aimless spaceship, that it'd end up like this. So that's why I want to continue to be your sidekick. When I keep reading about all these people from just 300 years before when I was alive, it reminds me a lot of my original time. But it also makes me feel like I'm completely unprepared to get by in a society like that. And that's just a difference of 300 years. So I think I could learn a lot from being an investigator like you, from being your sidekick. Could you tell me more about the job you're going to be doing when we get back to Earth? Gonna go with the dickish route. It's a paycheck. Ah, oh, well, that makes sense. Well, okay, I mean, it's not a dickish route, it's just kind of a, you know... It's not romantic or exciting. It's uh, It would be disappointing to her, I think. So you really are the cool type, then. You do amazing things, but you're all no big deal about them. I always liked movies where the, mo the hero was modest and cool about everything. I understand. It's all so much more exciting than being a housewife. And a little bit romantic, too. Uh, anyway... I guess I should probably stop distracting you from doing that job now. To figure out the whole story about what happened to the Magungwa in Year Zero. Let's continue to work hard together. I really am amazed she's still talking to me. I mean, obviously there is a point where she will break, as you saw in the cake thing, but... Even just with everything else I've done, she still... Not only does she still talk to me, she seems to still like me. Which is bizarre. Alright, I still have 500 messages from the previous block, but what the hell, I'm going to grab some more. It doesn't really particularly matter how you do it. 
do 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 ba da ba da bum ba ba da bum bum Yeah, when you go through the notes really fast, it kind of makes the music sound all weird. Because I'm guessing that there's transitions put in at certain points when you start reading a note or when you stop. And when you do it really fast, it seems to kind of mess it up a bit. Alright, let's read the previous ones that I did not touch. Okay, I think there's two more blocks to extract, and then we're done. Do you think she's still going to be want to be my sidekick? I've treated her like crap, but she does seem to still like me for some reason. I wonder if I get an option in the matter. I, d I can't remember exactly how it went. You know, exactly what my options were in the end. On the end of the last day. Oh god, the suicide note. I'm not going to read that. Don't think about it. Don't think about it. It's too horrible. Alright, three more to go. And that's it. Three more messages. And of course, by the way, I'm not going to stop at this playthrough. Next, I will be doing the female harem route and see where the heck that ends up. Okay, that's the last one. So, I guess this is it then. Yep. So, we've read everything we can before we return to Earth, I suppose. Thank you, Miss Investigator, for letting me play your sidekick. The past three days could have been really hard on me, but instead I got to experience what your job is like. And more importantly, we were finally able to solve the mystery of what happened in the year zero. It's still really hard for me to parse and understand. And really, there's just so much I don't know how to deal with. But I think it's really important that I now know. So uh, tell me, how do you feel about what we've read? What's the dickish option? Which one does she seem to like the least? This one she doesn't seem to like. So, so let's go with that. Ah, oh god, I'm sorry, Hyane. I hate everyone equally. It's troubling, isn't it? Reading all this, I wish there was just a clear hero and villain and I knew who to root for. But I guess, I mean... Don't get me wrong, the actions of Emperor Ryu and Oyana were terrible. The worst. Horrifying. But I guess they're just people, in the end. I know, that's the most... That's one of the really interesting things about this game, is just how humanized and how deep the characters are. They're not... They're not just simple good and evil. That's something that always bores me to tears, 
when you see that in in any sort of work of art, good and evil, whether it be books, movies, TV, whatever, it doesn't matter. You know, the fight between good and evil, darkness and light. That's boring as hell. It doesn't make for an interesting dynamic. It's just, it's, it's lazy, it's easy, it's plain. And it's not even close to reality. Reality is very rarely ever that clear-cut at all. These people, Ryu and Oyana, they were terrible people. There's no doubt about that, they were terrible people. But they were people, they weren't evil, or at least they weren't purely evil. It just, it doesn't work out that way. And... And that is a good sign that you have well-developed characters, is when even the bad people, the people that you hate, aren't just bad. They're not just evil, assuming they even are evil. They're people. It's, um... It's disturbing. You know, it's, it's easy. It's easy and it's comforting, I think, to have a clear evil, to, you know, say this person is separate from me, this person is not even human, or something like that, you know, to dehumanize them and turn them into just a caricature. But I think the realization that the elements that make, like, how do I express this? The, the bad people, the people we don't like, it's, I think it's hard to take that they're human and that there's bits of them in all of us, you know? You want to separate yourself. You want to say, I'm nothing like that at all. But that's not always true. At least, not completely. I heard a, There's a really good quote I heard a while ago, years ago, that perfectly summed up what I'm trying to express, but I can't remember it. Heck yeah, I can't remember it. I don't even know who it was by, but oh well. Hopefully you get what I mean. I don't get it. I wish there was some easy takeaway. Well, changing the subject to something less heavy. What do you think of the past three days, though? Do I make a good sidekick? Oh my god. It's gonna be horrible. I'm going to totally reject her. What's worse? I don't really care, or you have a lot to learn. I think I don't really care is worse. You have a lot to learn. That doesn't imply that she's that you don't want her as your sidekick. Or anything like that. It just means that, you know, she could be better. But I don't really care. That just that's. That's just painful. God damn it, and I'm gonna press it. I don't really care. Oh. Uh, well, that's honest, at least. Well, maybe that's just how it is. Anyway. Please, don't be mad, because I'm so happy for everything you've done for me. But we've had so much trouble together on this voyage home. I just don't know if us being together can work. If you'll let me, I think it would be best for both of us if we parted ways when we, when we reached Earth. Okay, so yeah, this is going to lead to a different ending. Oh my god, you can say I won't allow it? Which makes me think of the movie Troll... What was it called? Troll 2? Nilbog. I won't allow it! <laughs> that movie is amazing. <sighs> but yeah, you can say I won't allow it. What, can you like keep her as a fucking slave or something? Can you actually do that? That's horrible. Okay, yes, that's for the best. Ah, well. Thank you for understanding. You've been good for me. I'll always remember you. I'm sorry, it couldn't have worked out. I guess that's just how it is. But thank you. You're such a good person, and you always make the right decision decisions when it counts. I have not been a good person, Yane. I've been terrible. Well, anyway. I suppose it's now almost time to begin star system entry procedures. Even from out here, I can see Earth on the visual sensors, and it's gorgeous, isn't it? Wow. No matter what happens, no matter how bad I feel about what I've learned, no matter how much I need to learn about people, no matter how hard it is to be a proper adult, no matter what, I'm going to take all the things that shaped me, that shaped what kind of ship I grew up on, and I'm going to try to put them behind me. Even if there's still so much ahead of me, thank you so much for rescuing me. Thank you for being here for me. Thank you for saving me from that prison and putting up with me. Maybe I was a little too naive about things working out between us, but I don't blame you. Maybe that's just sometimes how it is. Maybe sometimes two people just aren't compatible. 
but you saved me from despair, gave me hope, and saved my life. No matter what, I promise, that's what I'll always remember you by. From here on out, the possibilities of my future are terrifying and overwhelming. What an unbelievable feeling, being overwhelmed by freedom. God, I feel so bad for her. I mean, she, she's being remarkably strong about this. But after everything she went through, in my original ending, after everything she went through, I, I was still there by her side to help her and to guide her along. But now she's going to have to go out on her own into a society she doesn't know at all? After everything that's happened to her? That's, that's terrifying. That is absolutely terrifying. And she has to do it alone. And that would be terrifying to do with someone else. But to do with no one to support you? Oh my god. Oh, wow. Are you sure you want to shut down for today? Yes. I guess that's all then. Well, thank you again for rescuing me. I'll never forget you. Alright, what's my ending gonna be? Okay, yeah, it's just like the, uh, the mute ending where she goes off on her own. Although it looks like she doesn't have, at the moment, she doesn't have any people she knows. She's going out into the, into the world, confused, alone. I'm hoping the next image I see is, like, her friend showing up or something. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, nope. Nope, she's alone. Ah, oh, that's... That's that's a sad ending. Jane, alone ending. Okay, let me try something else. Uh, which save game? This one? Okay, I'll... I want, I'm curious what saying I won't allow it will do. What the hell does that do? Let's find out. That sounds horrible. Oh. Well, if that's how it is, then I suppose that's just how it is. What the hell kind of an ending is this going to get you? I, I mean, God, I gave her freedom and now I'm taking it away and keeping her as my, like, personal AI slave or something? That's sick. Believe me, I know. I have plenty of experience with that. Oh my God. I guess that's just how it is. Well, anyway, I suppose it's now almost time to begin Star System Entry Procedures. I think the rest is the same. Oh, no, this is different. Hold on. Maybe this future... Uh, this future, too, isn't everything I dreamed it would be. Maybe, in the end, I've just traded one inner chamber for another. God, who would do this ending other than just for curiosity's sake? This is horrible. But at least I'm alive. Jesus. Traded one inner chamber for another, but at least I'm alive. Uh, I'm alive and I'm not alone. You're not... You're not alone, but you're with your fucking captor. Uh. This is horrible. I guess that's all, then. Next time we talk, we'll be on Earth. I can't wait. I can't wait. I guess she's... in a... like, in a bird cage, Figuratively speaking. Talking to a bird. Caged, yep, caged bird ending. Is she actually smiling at me? I, I don't know. I, I don't. I don't see why she would like me at all after I've now kept her prisoner. That is a horrifying ending. That is really disturbing. You freed her from all of the shit she had to put up with, and then put her inside of a figurative cage. Dear God. Okay, I kind of feel horrible ab about myself now that I've tried these terrible options like yeah uh, but now we know all right so how many endings does that make uh, I believe that means I've now experienced 
six endings, right? I experienced the Shanae as my wife, um, Mute as my sidekick, the Harem ending, and then I did Mute, um, Mute Alone, that's the fourth one. And now I've experienced the Hyane uh, Alone ending and the Hyane uh, Cage Bird ending. So yeah, that's six endings. I thought I read somewhere that there's eight. I'll need to double check that, but I thought there was eight. I wonder what the other ones could be. Hmm. Okay, yeah, well, that is the end of my... I hope everyone enjoyed. That is the end of my uh, female Hyane treat her like total crap playthrough, which I feel terrible about. And in the next episode, I'm going to do the female harem route and see where that leads. I hope you enjoyed, everyone. Goodbye.